Good morning Terraria players and welcome yet again to the Calamity Mod One Block Challenge. I am Bladeburger, your local bundle balloon simp, and today we continue forward, taking on more mechs and some angry worms. As usual, here's a mod list for this series, with Calamity and the One Block mod made by Chabamba. If you have a mod suggestion, let me know down below, whether it be a large content mod or a smaller quality of life mod. With all that out of the way, let's get back into the playthrough. Like last episode, I started right off with a boss fight against the Destroyer. The rest of the mechs will be quick as I went right through them in this run, wanting to get the upgrades that they offer. So without further ado, here's the painful fight against the Destroyer.
Next up, so quickly is my fight against Skeletron Prime. Enjoy the fight. When Skeletron went down, Chlorophy was actually added to the loot pool for the one block. With the souls acquired, it was time for some upgrades. I love the bundle of balloons, so I crafted the Moab, an upgrade to them and a jetpack. I also upgraded my boots to Angel Trends, allowing me to go pretty fast. The final upgrade before getting to the next boss was to upgrade my Spirit Rune into a Holodrum, buffing the power of the buffs I received when a summon I controlled dealt damage. Next up, I AFK mined a little bit to get Chlorophyte from the one block pool. I made a ton of bars for later, then proceeded to create an arena for the boss I had actually skipped 
the aquatic scourge because it enrages outside of both the sunken sea and the ocean. I had to block off the border, as well as the ceiling of both biomes. There was also the waterless abyss that would damage me as well if I got too close, so I had to block that off too. The arena ended up pretty small, but functional. I then waited for a natural spawn of the Scourge as I couldn't have tamed shark fins at the current moment. Let's see how this arena does. When the Scourge went down, the next tier of the Acid Rain event began. As I have an actual Sulfurous Sea biome this time, I'll showcase the event for a little bit before continuing. When the event finished, it was time to open the treasure bag. Inside, it held weapons from its loot pool, a bleached angler kit, which was like the one the Desert Scourge dropped, and its expert mode item, which acted as a more powerful variant of the Desert Scourges, upgrading defense but lowering movement speed as you sat submerged in water. Its treasure bag had a summon weapon, which I definitely used. It summoned a tiny starfish thing. Essentially all the loot from the Aquatic Scourges loot pool is just an upgrade to the Desert Scourge one. Next up, I remember that I could get Cryonic Ore since now two mechs were defeated. Underground, I sat in my underground ice biome, waiting for Cryonic Slimes. After a while, I was able to get enough ore to upgrade my armor. I crafted Daedalus Armor for Summoner. Its set bonus gave 20% minion damage, created a turret over your head, and gave two minion slots. I then made the Sun God Staff, an upgrade to the Sun Spirit Staff, but bigger. 
and then crafted Starlight Wings. Calamity gave wings their own stats and bonuses if you have matching armor for a lot of the wings. These wings gave good damage buffs when wearing Daedalus armor. I then crafted the Onk Shield, and as the final upgrade for this episode, I made the Ornate Shield. It gave a large boost to defense and a dash, and boosted defense and damage while wearing Daedalus armor. And with that, we round out this episode. Let's take a look at upgrades, shall we? For weapons, we went from the Black Hawk Remote to the Sun God Staff to the Deep Sea Staff. For armor, we went from Spider Armor to Daedalus Armor. For accessories, we added the Ornate Shield and the Starlight Wings to my equipment and upgraded to the Angel Treads and the Hollowed Rune. In the next episode, we go to Plantera and beyond, getting into the real meat and potatoes of this mod. Stay tuned for next week for that. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Blade Burger out.